All right, this is a super quick, super fast tutorial on disabling auto catch in Skater XL. If you want the game to be a little bit harder, like I do. So you're gonna need this program, DNSpy, uh, which is used for decompiling code. Uh, and you're gonna load in the assembly C sharp file, which is in the Skater XL data folder in your managed folder. Then you're gonna go all the way down. You're gonna go to uh, this hyphen right here, expand it and you'll go down to the first one we're going to do is in player state pop and what you're looking for down here is there's two methods in here if i can find them uh, i already commented them out but the ones you're looking for are on left stick update and on right stick update or uh, on left stick centered update right here there should be code right here but there isn't any more because I got rid of it. So what you do is you right click on it, edit method, and then anything under there you either delete or comment out and just hit compile. And then the other one we're looking for is in player state released. And again, you're looking for uh, the same exact thing on left stick centered update and on right stick centered update. And same thing, you just completely remove whatever is there, comment it out, delete it. And then when you're done with that, you go back up to save code and just, you know, let it overwrite your C sharp file. And when you come back, you will have this. A game that does not catch the board for you. If you let go of the stick, it just keeps going. Only way to catch is by actually clicking in the stick. So there you go. Nice and easy.